Vice President Gore, Presidents Lash, Prince, Simmons, and Longsworth, trustees, faculty, students, staff, alumni, invited guests. I am Sigmund Roos, chair of the board of Hampshire College and a member of Hampshire's entering class of the fall of 1973. It is my great pleasure and distinct honor to welcome all of you to the inauguration of Jonathan Lash as the sixth president of Hampshire College. In 1966, in the making of a college, Franklin Patterson and Charles Longsworth asserted the following. The task of the college is to help its students learn to live their adult lives fully and well in a society of intense change, immense opportunity, and great hazards. The college must help them acquire the tools with which it looks as though men and women in the future may become most likely to be able to build lives in a society they consider worthy. Hampshire College, Longsworth and Patterson wrote, is committed to a view of liberal education as a vehicle for the realization of self in society. As many of us can testify, Hampshire College remains dedicated to Longsworth's and Patterson's view of liberal arts education. In the 46 years since the publication of The Making of a College, Hampshire's alumni have successfully achieved the goals that Longsworth and Patterson set for us and in ways that those two founders could never have imagined at the time. More than any college I know, Hampshire graduates men and women who are not only active learners, but who are also committed in very direct ways to meet the challenges we all face in this world. They embody our motto, non satisfactory, to know is not enough. And today, consistent with that motto and guided by those same ideals expressed in 1966, we install a new president. Jonathan Lash is a man whose personal, academic, civic, and professional pursuits have been shaped by an awareness that knowing is not enough, by a commitment to serious critical analysis, and by an equally deep commitment to using that analysis to address some of those global hazards that Longsworth and Patterson saw on their horizon. In those ways, and in many others, Jonathan embodies is the embodiment of Hampshire College and an aspirational model for our students and our graduates. When considering what to say today to help frame this important occasion, I turned to the works of Ralph Waldo Emerson, introduced to me by Professors Smith, David Smith, and Richard Lyon 37 years ago. In his Harvard Phi Beta Kappa Lecture of 1837, later known as the American Scholar Lection, Lecture, Emerson said this, quote, colleges can only highly serve us when they aim not to drill, but to create, when they gather from far every ray of various genius to their hospitable halls, and by the concentrated fires set the ears of the youth on flame. Emerson's plea for a new kind of American scholar was considered radical for his time. He hoped that colleges would begin to produce humans not defined by a profession, but rather liberated by it. Humans for whom action is essential, not subordinate. According to Emerson, without action, a scholar is not yet human. Without it, thought can never ripen into truth. While the world hangs before the eye as a cloud of beauty, we cannot even see its beauty. Inaction is cowardice, but there can be no scholar without the heroic mind. 175 years later, I believe Emerson would be proud and hopeful to, to, know, to know today's American scholars, prominent among them, Jonathan Lash. Jonathan's innate curiosity, his analytic acumen, his temperament of passion infused with respect for listening, his own career of informed activism, all of these characteristics feed Jonathan's optimism that educating the next generation of young people is what will ultimately change our world for the better and to secure a sustainable future. This is the mutual hope and understanding that drew Hampshire College and Jonathan Lash together, and we are all the better for it. So on this day, April 27, 2012, the anniversary of Ralph Waldo Emerson's death, we remember Emerson, honor his memory, and fulfill both his hopes and ours 
with the inauguration of Jonathan Lash as the sixth president of Hampshire College. Thank you.